All right, welcome to opening day. I am headed to film Brian and his daughter's boyfriend try to kill his first turkey, hopefully. So, first day, opening day, excited to be out. Should be a good morning. Hopefully, we see some birds. Uh, it rained last night, so hopefully, they'll work here today. Well, we just got here, uh, got to the bottom. So we're gonna. Hopefully hear one gobble here pretty quick and see if we can't get set up on him. It's going to be kind of a run and gun day, so stay with us and hopefully we'll get a big bird on the ground for crew to start the season off. So here we go. There we go. Let her in the back fly at me. Your call. You're the turkey whisperer. Well, yeah, I whispered real good earlier. <laughs> so, how motivated are we? Do we want to be overachievers and go all the way back to the back and wade water? Or do we want to be underachievers and go to the farm where we probably should have already killed like five there anyway? I don't give a crap, man. What do you want to do, Brian? Huh? What does Z Brian Crompton want to do? Let's go. Let's go. Here's mine. You've never killed a turkey before, right? No. Uh, have you been before? Uh, once I was really young. So this is like the first time you've been since you were really young. Yeah. yeah. My family has my family has a turkey hunt, so. You got yeah. a good taste of how it normally goes this morning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I never I never got into it. I, I always wanted to get into it. I never, no way, no way, family does. Yeah. You, you got a good taste of your heart beating because they're coming right to you. You hurry up and wait. Yeah. You just gotta watch out for their eyes. That's about it. Well, here we go. We got crew. Crew got in here. Finally, he's a little bit nervous about this talking on camera stuff. So we're gonna, we're gonna teach him. Me and Brandon are gonna get him broke in the right way. But uh, we just got the truck loaded. Got the decoys thrown in. Uh, Looks like it's going to be a pretty good morning. It's still a little bit hazy, a little bit of misty rain going on, but it's going to clear up quick. Sun's going to shine this morning, and it's going to be a good day. I think these turkeys ought to hammer. So, um, talk to crew back in the winter time. So we, we got him a first season, a first season permit. So, we're going to get him out there and see if we can't can't lay the hammer down, get him that first turkey, maybe hang that thing on the wall. So, you ready to go? Yeah. You excited a little bit? Yeah, I am. You're nervous. Nervous? Is, is it hard to talk on that camera? Yeah. No, okay. it, it's just you just gotta tell a story, buddy. That's all we gotta do. So and stay it's with the us. Eclipse. Oh well, I forgot about that. And we got the eclipse today, so we've got all the the city crazies in town. Um, everybody's everybody's fogging in because I guess we're at the one of those spots that it's gonna get dark the, the best or something. I don't know. So all I, all I'm worried about is the turkey's gonna roost twice today. Are they are they going are they going we're gonna get a roost hunt right off the bat, and then we're gonna get to watch them. Watch them roost again here about one o'clock or two whenever this whenever this eclipse thing happens. So, so stay with us. We're gonna get go get crew uh, crew on one this morning, and we're gonna maybe walk a few miles off these boots. Like I said before, this is a run and gun spot. So, we're gonna go go put our miles in and see if we can't get one down. So, stay with us. We'll see you in the woods. Sit down right here. Get up against 
mystery. I think it's right now. Quick, quick, quick. Okay, don't run. Are they coming? He's flopping. Hang on, hang on. Tell me about it. Yeah, he doubled. Gotta go. <laughs> Heck Ooh. yeah, buddy. Let's go Ooh. check these things out. What do you think of that? Not bad. Not bad. Tell us a little bit about what happened, crew. They, they went straight toward the decoys, and I said I shot the first one, and we realized we had he had the tag, so we shot the second one. Yeah. And doubled. Okay. Got, got a little double. Yeah. Not bad. First season's coming to an end, so got a couple more days left. You got school, and so we're still gobbling back in there. Yeah. I'll grab him, throw him over with the other one, and we'll uh, We'll be some turkey sandwiches tonight. <laughs> well, <laughs> one of those situations where you go a hundred thousand mile an hour and just get it pulled off in time. So, we just walked, a, like I say, a long way back in here. We probably walked at least two miles back here. The creek had been out, a muddy mess back here. We'd heard some turkeys gobbling back in here yesterday with when we were with Brandon and. We were up on the other end of the farm, and so we knew there was some birds back here. So we came around the long way. The creek waded a lot of water where the creek had been out, a lot of mud, and got back in here. I mean, what we yelped one time? Yeah, once or twice. Yelped once or twice. I mean, they these immediately struck in and hammered back at us. I mean, they closed the distance from about 150 yards to about 70 just instantly. So we made a big circle back around them, uh, went all the way back to the middle of a, of a tree program in the mud, and circle all the way back through that and got ahead of where we thought they were going and like I said we just got set up got the decoys out and I mean Chris said I see them I mean I just had got back got didn't even have all the camera equipment set up yet Chris said I see them and um, I mean once they locked on the old the old avian x Jake decoy and, and a hen I just had time to get the two out I wanted to get a strutter out but we just didn't have time to do it and got uh, got them put out those those uh, they saw those and locked on I mean they they come a little quicker when they see decoys, don't they? A little quicker. We've been fighting the last couple of days. We've been fighting the hand up game where they've been sitting yeah. in the woods wanting to gobble and just set, make you make you sit and watch them is what we've been doing. And this first season's been rough. I mean, they've been hand up bad, and so uh, crew's getting a, a taste of what it's like to to chase these things. A little bit of running gun turkey hunting, and so it's a uh, it's been a good time, crew. Like I said, this is crew's first first experience turkey hunting, and. Um, I know me and him and Brandon had a great time yesterday and come out here and wore a little bit of rubber off the bottom of his boots today covering some ground. But we did the old switcheroo where he laid the hammer down on his first one and everybody knows how I am. I ain't going to pass up a turkey sandwich. So, so it, uh, 
we got the got the old double done. He passed the gun off to me, and I laid the smack down on the other one. And so that's a wrap for the next couple of days. We can sleep in and get this first season's done now. And Leah and Brandon are waiting to get the bingo tech, so we're gonna have to send that out here pretty quick and let them know we got her done. So, so what do you think all this turkey hunting? You hooked now? Yeah, I am. Hooked. Yep, it's a good time, isn't it? So, well, congratulations, buddy. Thanks. It's good stuff. Don't happen like that every day. So. First day of, we're getting to hunt. We missed last weekend because Leah had a track meet. So we're gonna go try it today. The wind, wind's still blowing about 70 mile an hour, it seems like. I mean, it's really probably blowing in the 40, probably 40 mile an hour. Um, had some really bad, a couple of really bad tornadoes came through last night. So I don't think they're gonna gobble this morning at all. So don't think it's gonna be a real good day, but, uh, but hey, we're, we're turkey hunting. And we may be, may be shooting turkeys as they blow by today, but we're gonna, we're gonna go give it a try, so you can't kill them sitting in the house. We're gonna go get after them and see what we can't get done. Well, at least it's not windy. There's a turkey in those trees. They're surfing up there.
Yeah! <laughs> Hello, mine's still floppy. It's okay. You're dead. I think I just shot him a little bit low. No, you got him good. Oh, look at there. Did you see it? You'll have to go back. Hang on, hang on. I shot it and knocked me back out of my chair. It's dead. Yeah. There's one. There's the other one. Turkey number two. Yeah. So close to the decoys. They were right up in it. Hang on. Oh, we knocked the 360 over. Yeah, no, whenever I shot, it, it shoot knocked it, did you? It, No, it knocked me back to, like, and I, luckily, my chair was close to the water when I flipped over. I told Leah this morning, I said, we're going to take take my gun in and your gun, and so not least turkeys roost here by this by this plot lot, so we put a spread out kind of on a, on a hope they were here, and it sounded like there was three of them roosted right back in here off the plot, several back in the back again, but... They, uh, when they finally come in, saw that strutter, got to the edge of the field, saw that strutter and that Jake decoy, they came, they came hard. So that's, uh, that's several turkeys out of this plot. So, so we, what do you think of that? I'm just happy that we finally got one to come in the field. Yeah, that's it's no been kidding. Rough season. It's been rough. These turkeys have been hinned up so bad. We couldn't do anything with them. We've had them in, had some in range and, haven't been able to do anything with them because trying to get them get her ready to go and and uh, and get the camera on them. We've we've had to pass a couple because they came in. Well, whenever uh, I'm on them, you're not on them. Yeah. Whenever you're on them, I'm not. Kind of seems like that's how it's been all season. One of us has been on them, you know, with the camera. The other one hasn't been able to get a shot, and, and vice versa. So it don't get any better than that. So that's uh, that's a. Uh, that's a good deal. She's still got one tag left to fourth season, and we'll see if we can't get one done then in a couple weeks. But uh, as for right now, we are tagged out with the landowner's tags in Illinois. So, so we'll uh, slide down here and get them real quick and look at these big old roosters. So see which one's the biggest. I'm <laughs> I'm going with, I'm pretty sure Dad's is going to be the biggest. Mm, no. I don't know, you shot the big strutter, so I don't know, I may be in trouble this time. So what do you think? Let's go get them. It don't get any better than that, huh? Nope. Yeah, somebody finally woke up. We tried to do an interview <laughs> earlier and she said, oh, Grouchy Buns here said, said, I'm tired, I'm still sleeping. I don't want to talk on camera. So so we didn't get much of, a, of an interview this morning. So we'll... Uh, Sometimes teenage girls in the morning are, aren't real happy to... It was to, nap time. She's more of that 10 o'clock to, to, to <laughs> 1 o'clock type of a turkey hunter, I think. That's so, the best time. That's yeah, the best time, huh? So, well, we're going to slide down here and go recover these two turkeys. And I'm going to do my favorite thing after after we get them recovered. We're going to get them cleaned up and, and fry turkey tonight. And that, that's the best thing about killing these turkeys is what I like to eat them. So... We'll be back. Not the day that we were going to hope to have. It's super rainy and gross outside. But we already have a bunch of Tom's cop went over there and we didn't think they'd got one all today. But, uh, it should be our lucky day because we didn't think they were going to gobble at all and they're gobbling a lot. But uh, hopefully they'll come in in the Lukowski while we got the decoys out and we remembered my chair today. So hopefully it'll be a good day.
Wright is the biggest, I think. The strutter. Easy, easy. easy. They saw you. Easy. Alright, stand up. Right up. Easy. Turkey gang fight. Well, Leah didn't get to hunt yesterday. She had a had a softball game, and uh, so we didn't get to, didn't get to hunt yesterday. It was probably a perfect morning. I mean, it was it was sunny and uh, no wind. It was a beautiful morning, but today uh, it couldn't get conditions couldn't get much worse. I mean, it's 30 mile an hour winds, at, you know, gusts up to 35. It's raining. I mean, it's just nasty. We didn't didn't get a lot of footage coming in because it was raining. I didn't want to get the camera stuff wet, but. Um, I mean, they did gobble a little bit on the roost, flew down, and we had five or six toms and a bunch of jakes that were right here close, like they always are right here. And 
So we're gonna get everything cleaned up in this redneck. We got this big old Tom laying out here in the decoys. So here comes a bunch more coming in here. So we'll see if we can get a little footage of them. And when they get out of here, we'll get down. Huh? So what do you think? Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Another, another great hunt. We're laying the daddy-daughter duo. We're laying it down. <laughs>